Cedric Irvin, coach running back. Well, I came from the University of Alabama, where I was there two seasons. And in the two seasons, uh, my record is 26 and 2. And I was an intern there with the running backs, but I basically did most of the stuff that I'm doing now as far as the intern. You know, I had a great relationship with all the players. You know, my relationship now is just like a big brother. You know, even to this day. I mean, we talked, matter of fact, the other day. You know, he comes, he came, he's coming to my family reunion. So we have a relationship where, you know, I'm the big brother, and he, he called me, asked me for anything or any questions and, you know, stuff that I taught him that I learned throughout my career, you know, he's still working on now. I always learn three ways you learn, watching, listening, and doing. And, and that's the way I teach. Coach Porter played running back, coached running back. And, and so I guess, you know, that's kind of the relationship that we have. I guess you want to call it university of running backs. You know, it's a lot of things that he see that I see, same terminology. You know, uh, he know a little more than me, so I'm learning from him because, you know, he coached a lot of great guys that, he, that was average backs that he made good, and that's in the NFL also. So, you know, I want to follow along that path also. He's a winner. You know, everything that he's doing with this program is, is about winning. I guess just like Coach Porter to win. I mean, I, I'm going to be realistic. I know there are going to be some bumps in the road, but I think we're going to do a lot better than what some people may think. You know, even if it's not in the victory column, you know, like I said, you're building a program. And like I said, if, I, if you look at Alabama, their first year they were 7 and 6. You know, the next year they was 12 and 2. And the next year they were 14 and 0. You know, so if you give the way Coach Porter is going, you give him a chance, an opportunity. I think he's going to build a type of program that, you know, the people around here in Memphis and Memphis fans are going to love. I love the ribs. You know, they're great. Uh, Elvis, you know, everywhere I go, you know, some people tell me about Elvis to go to the museum and stuff like that. But like I said, there's a lot more life here than where I came from. So I, I love the city.